Hey guys, welcome back to another video today. I hope you guys are doing okay. Um, today we're going to the best Michael Myers build of July 2020. Um, now each month I do every single uh, killer and obviously the best build of that month. Today is Michael Myers. This is 100% my opinion of why I think this is the best build. Now uh, if you're also new to the series, uh, we also do in this series, we uh, get the perks, what the perks do, how they all synergize together to make a build. Um, obviously the best build of July 2020 and how we can improve the build in general. So it would be really nice if you can drop a like on this video, subscribe to the channel. And yeah, no more time, let's go right to the perks. So the perks we have here is Barbican Chili, Pop Goes the Weasel, Infectious Fright and Corrupt Intervention. So what Barbican Chili does, each time after hooking the survivor, all other survivors in the map auras are revealed to you for 4 seconds. Now the auras won't be revealed to you if you have perks. Uh, to counter it if they're hiding in the locker or they or they ain't in the 40 meter range each time that survivor is hooked for the first time get a 25% stackable bonus to all blood point gain uh, and gain up to a uh, maximum of at level 1 50% BP level 2 75% BP at level 3 100% BP so what pop goes the weasel does so each time after the hook on the survivor the next generator you kick is instantly regressed by 25% of its total progress after you kick it uh, normal generator regression applies after the damage. So um, at level 1 you get 40 seconds to get the generator. At level 2 you have 50 seconds to get this generator. And at level 3 you have 1 minute to get the generator. So what Infectious Fright does, each time a survivor is put into a dying state, um, all survivors in your terror radius will yell. So if your terror radius is small, um, <laughs> like you have monitor, um, people in that terror radius, when they can hear your terror radius obviously, they will yell and if you have a big terrorist like you are doing like a massive terrorist kind of build they'll still hear it um, obviously they'll still scream so uh, yeah if you really, really want to use infectious um, I recommend using like a big terrorist build but it doesn't really matter anyway so um, at level 1 their location is revealed to you um, f for 4 seconds at level 2 5 seconds at level 3 6 seconds now what Corrupt Intervention does, the three generators that spawn, uh, spawn furthest from you are blocked by an entity for at level 1, 100 seconds, level 2, 110 seconds, and level 3, 120 seconds, which is 2 minutes. So right now, let's move on to the final thing of today's video. Let's see um, how we can improve this build. So how I've improved the build is I swapped out no perks, I've added two add-ons, one being rare and the other one being ultra rare and I added one map offering. So the rare one is called J Miles Memorial, this add-on moderately increases the rate of which evil with, um, within is gained when stalking the survivor and also stacks. So what the ultra rare add-on does, which is called Fragrant Tuft of Hair, this um, this gives you unlimited duration of evil free uh, of evil within free. Tremendously increases the amount of evil uh, within to reach the evil within free for the first time, and it's also stacks. So uh, yeah, and the map offering uh, which is Hawkins, <laughs> this is really good for Myers. Honestly, this is very killer style as well. This is really good for Myers as well. So uh, yeah, honestly, what do you guys think of this build? Do you think it's shit? Honestly, um, how I think it's good because you got the gem pressure, you got the information. You've got the infinite tier 3, you've got the Hawkins, you've got Corrupt um, at the start, and you've also got Infectious with the infinite, which is fucking amazing. So, uh, yeah, honestly, this build is also good in my opinion, uh, without the uh, add ons and the map offering, honestly. And if you guys want to see gameplay of this build, um, click in the description below. That's um, You'll find me playing gameplay of this build, just click in the description below the video there. That's me playing the build, uh, without the add ons and the map offering, obviously. And uh, yeah, just to show you how it, guys how it actually is, and I'm a rank one as killer as well. So that's enough proof for you guys. And uh, yeah, the next kill we're doing tomorrow is the hillbillies. So make sure you turn the notifications on so you're watching out for that. And yeah, if you guys drop a like on this video, that will help out much. Yeah, much appreciated if you did. Subscribe to our channel, help us reach 250 subs. Then I'll do the sub special. I haven't got it planned yet. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.